Hello everyone, this is a response to Eric Surf 6 video where he did a mathematical magic trick where you take a three digit number, there we go, 371, and you reverse it and subtract then you reverse the result and add and you always get the answer 1089. Now this will always work and you can prove this works by doing some algebra, just moving some symbols around on a page. Now this is the sort of thing that I usually try not to do in my videos, not because it's hard but because it doesn't make very good video. But this is what we'll need to do to prove that this always works. So we're going to take a three digit number, let's call that ABC. Now if you remember from school this is hundreds, tens and units, so we can write this as 100A plus 10B plus C. Now we're going to reverse the number and subtract, so let's do that. We reverse the number and subtract, this is what I've done here, and you get the answer 100A minus C minus A minus C. Now to tidy this up a little bit, I'm going to take A minus C there and I'm going to call that D. D for difference. I don't have to do this, I just do this to make it a little bit more tidy. So we've got now, this is exactly the same thing, 100D minus D. Now this number D, well if A is greater than C, then this number D is going to be between 1 and 9. Now I want to make this into a three digit number, so it's going to be hundreds, tens and units again. Well I'm going to do that with a slightly clever trick, I'm going to rearrange what we've got, 100D minus D, uh, so it looks like hundreds, tens and units, so it now becomes 100D minus 1 plus 90 plus 10 minus D. So I've taken one of these hundreds and I've just rearranged it and moved it about. Now this is a three digit number now. We're going to reverse this and add. Let's do that. If I reverse this number and add, this is what it looks like. That's exactly what I've done here. But all these D's, they start to cancel. And they start to cancel out and we get 100 times 9 plus 180 plus 9, which adds up to 1089. Now this will always work if your first digit is greater than your last digit. If the uh, two end digits are the same, you're just going to get zero. And if the first digit is smaller than the last digit, then you're going to get minus 1089. Now this trick um, talk, is talked about uh, in greater length, in greater detail, in a book called 1089 and all that by David Atchison uh, where he talks about other fun math things and this was the trick that actually got him interested in mathematics to begin with and it's a good book and I can recommend it. So uh, that is all for me for now so until next time see you later calculator.